everyone, it's David Bumble back with two very special guests. Justin and Tim, welcome. Thank you. It's good Thanks. to be here. If you don't know who they are, they're the authors of this book, fantastic book, Black Hat Python. I've got the original, well, the first edition of this book, should I say. And at the back here, it says, the difference between script kiddies and professionals is the difference between merely using other people's tools and writing your own. So I like that. Um, there is a second edition of this book. So, you know, either of you just answer the questions as, as you feel. Um, What's the difference between the first edition and the second edition? What this book does is it takes the first edition with the same ideas Justin had. And Justin wrote the first edition himself, but without me. And it's, it's his hacking ideas. Every chapter is a different hacking idea. And what I did was looked at it through a teacher's eyes and tried to add code and uh, reorganize code and bring it up to current standards with Python 3. When Justin was do, did the original, it was Python 2, and that's what everybody was using. So now everybody's using Python 3, basically, and that was a, a breaking change for Python. And so there was a little work to upgrade it to, to port it to Python 3. Um, and also, as I was using it as something to teach from um, locally, just uh, to local security experts, I found what my students were getting bogged down with or, you know, they needed a little help. And so I added some more explanation to the book. And also um, at the time, you know how security changes so fast. Yep. And uh, the first edition, I think, was 2015. And Windows XP was what everybody was using. And so now most people are using Windows 10 or 11. And it, this is only just about the Windows portions. There's a few chapters that are Windows specific. And so I upgraded those to uh work with Windows 10 and 64-bit machines, where in the past it was for XP and 32-bit. So it's up to date on the current, right now, uh, computers and software uh, operating system that people are using, and also updates to Python 3 and the new packages. But it stays with, with Justin's original ideas on each chapter. 